Congratulations, graduate, or almost graduate, that is. Your hard work has paid off, and now you are about to complete an important educational goal at College of DuPage. It's an exciting time to celebrate. Caps and gowns, pomp and circumstance, pictures, parties. Hey, you're graduating. You deserve every bit of attention that goes along with this achievement. To make sure the event is enjoyable for you, all of your classmates who will be graduating alongside you, and the guests who will have come to show their support and cheer you on, here's an overview of some of the important things you need to know before graduation. Who can participate? Any student who is on track to complete degree requirements by the end of the current academic year's fall, spring, or summer terms. If you are unsure or have any questions regarding your degree or certificate progress, please contact the records office. If you are on track, you must complete an application for graduation on my access to participate in the ceremony. For your name to appear in the commencement program, your application to graduate must be completed by the deadline for printing. Caps, gowns, and tassels, also called commencement regalia, are available for purchase at the COD bookstore. You must wear the appropriate hunter green cap and gown in the ceremony. Be sure to check the bookstore website for hours. Here are this year's prices for the items sold at the bookstore. Student members of honor societies may purchase stoles and or tassels that indicate their membership. Phi Theta Kappa members can purchase stoles and tassels from the front desk at the Office of Student Life in SSC 1217. Members of all other honor societies should contact their advisor. Please note, students may only wear one tassel, stole, and honors cord. Of course you'll want your proud friends and loved ones to attend the ceremony. A ticket is required for each and every guest, including infants. Each graduate is allowed to receive up to six guest tickets at first. If you would need additional tickets, you may sign up to request more tickets and you will be notified if additional tickets become available. A special entrance is available for guests in wheelchairs or for those who cannot walk long distances. Special seating accommodations are available for guests with wheelchairs. You must indicate on your response card if a guest will need special assistance in order to receive the special services information. There is also an insert inside the newsletter that has all the information your guests need to know. Make sure you give this insert to your guests when you give them their tickets. During the ceremony, a professional photographer will take your photograph as you receive your diploma. You will receive an email with a link to your pictures and ordering information if you are interested. Please fill out the photographer's card completely, even if you do not plan to purchase any photos. The commencement ceremony is a large event with a lot of people participating and attending, and a lot of details to coordinate. You want to have the perfect commencement experience on your day as much as we do. So for everything to go smooth, we must keep a strict schedule. 5.15 p.m., graduates arrive for rehearsal. 5.30 p.m., commencement rehearsal begins. 6.30 p.m., doors open for guests. 7 p.m., commencement begins. 9 p.m., or immediately after the ceremony ends, reception begins. All graduates must attend rehearsal the evening of the ceremony. Grads should arrive at the Physical Education Center Arena at 5.15. Rehearsal begins immediately at 5.30. It is very important that all graduates are on time to participate in rehearsal. After rehearsal, all graduates will exit the PE arena in procession and go into the back hall of the BIC building. Graduates will not be able to see their guests between the rehearsal and the ceremony, so please make sure your guests have their tickets and ceremony information before rehearsal. The ceremony will begin precisely at 7 p.m. in the Physical Education Center Arena. There will be no place for you to store your personal belongings, so please do not bring anything that you do not want to carry with you during the procession. At the conclusion of the ceremony, graduates will be part of the processional out of the arena. 
You may then proceed to the Mac courtyard for the reception or exit through the big building. Be sure to arrange a place other than the PE arena to meet your guests after the ceremony. Graduates will not be allowed back into the PE arena after the ceremony. So, that covers the basics of what you need to know for graduation. But if you do have questions, help is always available. The Office of Student Life is a good place to start for most commencement questions. You may also need to contact the Records Office. A lot of details and contact information can also be found on our website, cod.edu slash commencement. Congratulations again. College of DuPage is excited to celebrate this accomplishment with you and wishes you continued success in your future.